welcome to Kayla Jordan TV. Today we are going to be making cheesecake brownies. Well, it's mainly the cheesecake and then brownie swirl. Kind of like my red velvet cheesecake brownies that were the brownies and then the cheesecake swirl. So it's just like opposite. So, I don't know if that made sense. But, it's super good. Continue watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. So the first step in making our brownie cheesecake is to make our Oreo crust, of course. So we're just gonna put our Oreos into the food processor. So now that our crumbs are ready, we are going to put in our melted butter. And turn that on high until it's incorporated. So now our Oreos are nice and combined with the butter and we are just gonna pour it into our dish. Now I'm going to flatten out the middle part of it now after I did the sides and press that in. You could either do that with your hands to make sure it's firmly packed or you could just do it with a spoon. This is perfect, it's all set to go. Now we're just gonna set this aside and move on to our filling. So now onto our filling, we're just gonna make our original cheesecake like normal. Uh, putting in our cream cheese, and then we're gonna put in our sugar, and then our two eggs, and vanilla. And we're just gonna mix that up. We're gonna scrape down our bowl. All right, now we're going to mix it again. All right, perfect. Now we're going to put this into our dish. Now we're just gonna set this aside and make our brownie filling. So the first step in making our brownie filling, we of course are going to put in our softened butter and cream together our butter and sugar. Then we are going to add our cocoa powder. Now we are going to move on to our vanilla and egg. Now it's time to add all of our Dry ingredients, the same bowl. So we have our cornstarch and baking powder in here, and our salt. And then just go ahead and add that to our batter. Okay, so now we have our brownie batter here. We are just gonna make decent size lines going across. We're just gonna fold that into the cheesecake and going up, back and forth motion. Okay, so now I swirled it all in. It's all mostly towards the middle and I'm gonna pop this in the oven at 325 degrees for 30 minutes. But this just came out of the oven. Uh, my brownie cheesecake looks amazing. There's nice swirls happening over here. I'm gonna let it sit out for about 15 minutes and then I'm gonna be putting it into the refrigerator to let it cool for at least an hour before I cut into it. This is finally cooled off. I cut myself a piece. Never made this before, so I wanted to see how it tastes like. Pretty amazed. That brownie is like perfect in there. You can't even really taste the cakiness of the brownie. It's like smooth cheesecake texture through the whole thing with just that taste of the brownie. Thank you for watching. Here we go. Thanks for watching my video on how to make the cheesecake brownie. I hope you guys liked it. It was super, super good. I'm obsessed with the way it tastes. I really honestly feel like this is the best cheesecake that I have ever made. Even though I'm not really a huge fan of chocolate, but it was just like extra sweet just the way I like it. Definitely try it at home and send me your pictures. If you do try it, I would love to see them and I'll see you in my next video.